I'm Hunter. Welcome back to Let's Play Sword of the Samurai. So, let's see. Uh, equip more samurai, yes. Uh, it looks like the uh, graphics problem is not fixed. That's too bad because I tried a lot of other options and they all looked worse. <laughs> I don't know. Um, if it doesn't actually interfere with the text, reading the text like it was earlier, I might just leave it the way it is. All right. So I actually, oh, my men are maximized now. So let's see, I have 1,545 loyal warriors. That's enough. Uh, so I, I actually have options. For instance, if I wasn't uh, in the top position here, top hatamoto, I could try and uh, infringe on the honor of those uh, above me. But I just haven't gone that way in this particular game. All right, so I can get land. I could get men if I had more land. More men if I had more land. Let's try the uh, Kenjutsu again. Let's just try. Because I had positive results once. Whoops. Whoops. Yep, you probably shouldn't stand there. And the instructor goes down. Mm -hmm. That was some diligent practice. Hopefully I've improved my swordsmanship. Diligent. All right, so, yeah, as you can see, I have actually improved my swordsmanship, which are the the symbols that look kind of like some sort of Buddhist something symbol on the far right side of the screen. Uh, that's swordsmanship. All right, so another thing I can do is I can travel. All right, so there's a shrine up here in the upper uh, right. Village for a cup of sake. Uh, I think my honor's fine. I don't want. I don't like rice field. Or that that might be a village actually, but I don't care. It's just not necessary. So this is a shrine right here. I can't do anything at it. And this right here is a village. Yep, that's a village. The thing with the three stars. Village. Let's have a look at Echu Province. Well, here it is. Disrespectful thieves. You know, I'd actually kind of like to fight them if it wasn't going to be in a rice field, but I know it will be, so... Such disrespect. Chico. I wonder what I can do there. I'm surprised his name is coming up. Get out of that village. Stop stopping for cups of sake. It's not working out for you. Uh, this thing right here is the is the uh, uh, castle of the daimyo of Echu. And here we are on a road. What? An armed and boastful gang? Nonsense. This armed and boastful gang. Oh, this is just a rice field battle. What? I'm too old to be fighting in a rice field. Yeah, that's right, get confused, and then get shot. I did not want to fight in a rice field. Apparently there's a road running through this rice field. That's what that big brown thing would be. That's one dead spearman. 
Come on, guys. You can't win. You have lost. It might interest you to know that Extreme Honor is not the highest rank. Alright, this here is a bridge. It doesn't really mean anything to me. And here is... Oh no, that's the label for the next province over. And this thing here is a bandit camp. Even though there are no bandits in sight at present. And, uh, yeah, I can literally explore, uh, the, uh nation this way. Musashi province. I should probably just go home instead of messing around here, but I just wanted to show it off. Oh, and that thing with six stars is a city. What city? I could not say. I am not so well versed in the geography of Japan, but this right here is a city. All right, to the south. interesting thing I notice is nothing is happening with the other Hatamoto. Disrespectful thieves? No, not interested. There actually are events I'm interested in, but that's not one of them. Wow, this is a busy, busy and very mountainous province. Kozuke. Needless to say, when you're walking through mountains, you move even more slowly than you do when you're walking through uh, the... Uh... Wait a second, I wasn't in Musashi province, I was in Echigo. It is my, quote, fortune, unquote, to discover the fortified lair of the gang of bandits terrorizing this district. Uh huh. All right, why not? What the heck? You only live once. That's a bad place to leave a corpse. place to stand. No weaselly business like if I'm standing in one of those rooms where guys can walk around corners. Yep, it is my fortune to find these guys. Sure. Be clever. Uh, you weren't that clever, were you? ahead. Come on over. Get shot. This is a perfect place to stand. Get shot in the shoulder and die. This is too easy. I didn't even get to explore the rest of the place. That's fine. At least I survived. As a gardener must prune his garden, so must the peasants be regularly weeded to remove bad elements. I'm not even in, in our province. Alright, so anyway, as you can see... Mm, 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 mm. As you can see, Musashi province is highlighted. I do not know why. I will go there. Hopefully it's not something that requires 
uh, an army because I do not have an army. Get. Uh, maybe the river makes me slow too. I'm glad I didn't choose this province. It would take forever to get anywhere. Just a little, you know, consideration, you know. Come on. Uh, well, the truth is, I don't know why this province is highlighted. I don't see anything of interest in it. Oh well. At least I went here. Saw what there was to see. I don't know. There's nothing here except the labels for other provinces. Whatever. Well, get out of that village. Go visit the bandit camp here. Ah, uh, no. Alright, so we do have a road here which is going to be very useful since it goes through the mountains. Get out. You may be wondering what happened to the end of this episode. Well, I got a telephone call. And I made a fair attempt to continue the episode after the telephone call, but uh, I, I run the game in an emulator because I want the game to have sound, and it has to be recorded, and I don't have an old sound blaster in my new computer. And also, the new computer has like a graphics card that doesn't render colors. It doesn't have all the color palettes that they're that an old graphics card has and it doesn't have like the mode 14h or whatever it's called text in it so what all that means is some games just don't look right when they're in uh, ntvdm so i'm using an emulator and when i alt tab out of the emulator here's what happens look it's cute look it's so tiny see so tiny. So I actually recorded the end of the episode like this, forgetting that it was going to be tiny like this, and this is useless. But uh, anyway, I just walked back to my estate from the province that I was in. Nothing happened. Nothing. I didn't do anything. So anyway, next time on Let's Play Sword of the Samurai, I'm going to work on getting my uh, assets back up here. Uh, down here in the corner, this tiny little thing. What happens if I do this? Oh, that looks terrible. Ooh. Yeah. And here's the manual, which is full of good information, like what all those icons mean, although it doesn't really tell you what they... I guess they don't do anything, necessarily. I don't know. It's loaded with good information, though. It really explains what's going on and makes it... Uh, you know, more interesting. It fills in the blanks that the game doesn't fill in for you. Committing treachery against a rival. Treacherous murder. Treacherous theft. Treacherous frame-up. And assassination. How about that? If you become aged, you will find that your physical skills begin to decrease markedly. Yeah, I thought I was a little slow in that battle on the, uh, on the road. How about that? 